Hi everybody, I am Cookie Doe and welcome back to another episode of our Victoria 3 Let's Play as the CSA where we have grown a little bit. Uh, yes, last episode we did conquer a few more states from the United States. Uh, uh, we took Pennsylvania here, New Jersey and their part of Colorado because at some point I will definitely go ahead and uh, war with Mexico for this part of Colorado as well as maybe something else we'll see what we can do uh, and I have been uh, kind of going through just seeing uh, a little bit of my stock uh, as to where we stand with everything obviously we're still in this war uh, that France I think started because they're the initiators right uh, I think if they're on the left side, so they're the initiators. Uh, but we're helping out Britain. I mean, in quotations, helping out Britain for now. Uh, but what I've noticed, like, for example, here, if you go South Carolina, it's very much the most pronounced of it. Uh, none of my buildings can really hire that many people, even though there is 14.9 uh, peasants. And the thing is, everyone wants to try to go up I guess in class here uh, right there's the impoverished the lower strata which are impoverished uh, and we have the middle strata which are secure and the wealthy uh, upper class upper strata but when I look down here basically 60% of the population in South Carolina alone is Afro-American which you know we are the CSA meaning that 80% of the workforce is slaves or it's not 80 60% of the workforce are slaves so obviously in the building the urban buildings don't really hire so if you go to a tooling workshop there's a hundred workers right now I did switch a bunch of them to like rotary valve engines and all of that stuff uh, but they don't employ any uh, slaves. I mean, they can, and probably they would need some uh, laborers, but they're not uh, employing them because everyone else wants to kind of work in the little bit better uh, thing. Which one has a lot of employment here? Uh, the textile mill, for example, right? The textile mill is fully employed and I even switched it to uh, mechanized looms but the workforce here we get laborers 8,000 of them but there's no slaves in here so the laborers are doing all of the urban buildings uh, while all the slaves are being employed here by the uh, I guess agriculture and resources so if you go into cotton plantations which is almost fully stocked right it's fully stocked with slaves, but we don't have enough people or that want to become farmers for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, yeah, you see, so there's... See, you could not hire farmers due to machinists on logging camps in South Carolina with 262 qualifications. Qualifying farmers aren't willing to work for a wage, so... It's actually paying less because it's paying it's paying less because obviously the workforce is cheap that they're doing here so why would they pay these guys more uh, again I'm not a f I'm not 100% fully understanding because this is the first time me playing as a run uh, with slavery uh, enabled uh, but again we'll we'll try to make it work we'll see how it goes but for now uh, let's pick up the speed here and get going uh, we're building a whole bunch of buildings here some steel some more that some more universities some gold uh, that we have in Colorado uh, but yeah let's just keep building and seeing if we can get our GDP to go up uh, we are uh, what are we here we're number five well ahead of the US US is a major power now not even a great power uh, there's only six of us actually Ooh, Bavaria is actually doing pretty well. Prussia is obviously doing pretty well. Uh, we have now more 
oh no we're basically on par with the population as the US so hopefully we can get a little bit more uh, France kind of has quite a lot of uh, population but I think that might change here because uh, Okay, there we go. So we're getting some more people into Georgia here. That is good. So in Georgia, again, that problem is also pronounced here in Georgia as well. But I think we have, again, there's more laborers here than slaves. So I think it's not as big of a deal. But I could go in here and, like, get some more people to go to, like, Rotary Valve. Uh, on some of these certain things just so we can maybe get more people to be hired on things like mechanized loom go ahead and do that uh, furniture manufactories rotary valve yeah we'll definitely be having to uh, switch a bunch of this stuff around okay uh, unfortunately I can still send either of them into exile I'm just hoping one of them will die. You're 69 and you're 74. So please, can you die? See, you're an alcoholic. You already have uh, minus 10 character health. And what about Miss Tubman? Uh, you're pretty healthy for now. But let's see if we can... If we can get you to die, hopefully. Please do so. Uh, anyways, I was in Georgia. Uh, food, I can't do anything on. Arms industry, yeah, let's get rotary valve. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to switch around some of these things. Let's see what we can do. There we go. This war may be coming to an end. I mean, Britain is trying to invade them, but... They're defending pretty good. Okay, more people coming in. That's great. Okay, there we go. So now, this has now evened out a little bit more. Uh, fishing wharves, I can't do anything about. So workforce here. I do definitely have slaves in here. I wonder... Probably not laborers anyways in here. Uh, if you want peace, the armed forces suggest a more hardline foreign policy towards the United States due to our poor relations. Yeah, most definitely. So let's go ahead and do this. Uh, another place, Louisiana, which actually have enough people hired. But that's another one that has 42% of the population is slaves that are working in here. So maybe we can... Uh, give them more stuff to do in the planting and stuff but we'll see how that all goes so what do we need still more glass more engines yeah ah, there goes the revolution again and how many <coughs> wow excuse me <coughs> so again it's Texas and New Mexico So let's see if this is going to be able. Oh, we got some communist Canada happening here. That's not good there, buddies. Uh, but yeah, let's see what will happen with this revolution in here for now. But I do need to build more. So still more glass. Like we need glass like crazy. It's in It's insane. North Carolina, that's good. So let's build five more in here. Actually, I want to see if this is going to be helping anything. Um, yeah, South Carolina can't really do much. Uh, let's build five in Tennessee. Uh, some more engines would hurt. I mean, we could go to electric engines, but let's not do that at the moment. Okay, you're still building those. That makes sense. So let's you build there. 
Maybe some more of you guys would be also pretty nice. Um, yeah, why not? Build you five more in Pennsylvania. And... Yeah, steel mills are still coming in, so let's leave it at that. Uh, what do we have here? Yeah, let's get you political strength lessened here. That should be fine. There we go. So we're getting more Yankees coming in. That's absolutely fantastic. Oh, great. These guys are also would take... Mm, this is not the greatest. It still would be great if one of these two died, or both of them. I mean, they're quite old. Oh, man. More radicalism. More radicalism. Kind of don't want to lose the prestige, so let's just take the hit on radicalism. Yeah, there we go. It's extreme. Wonder if he can actually go ahead and do something with these guys. And I kind of want to do, if anything happens, these guys need a general. Uh, sure, let's get you going in here. Let's get you to advance front. Okay, where are you? You're in New England, so... Let's get you to switch over here now, for now, in case something happens. At this, so that we can just kind of go ahead and do that. I mean, Britain is kicking ass. They can't invade France proper. Uh, Britain, what do you want? You want to humiliate France, conquer Provence. Wow. Okay. So, it just, I think it was just basically a white piece at that moment. Uh, heavy handedness. Okay. William Washington. Oh, yeah, that's our king. Social Democrat. Okay. Uh, uh, let's just do this. That's fine. Uh, what I do want to do, though, uh, while we are waiting here, let's try to pass wealth voting here. Yes. Let's go ahead and try to pass that. This might actually help out with these guys. Yeah. Uh, well, we'll see what happens. Yeah, okay. She gained even more popularity now. Wow. It's 125. She's absolutely loved. But this is not going to progress any more than this anyways. Uh, oh, man. Some money to spend. Well, no matter what, we're spending money. So let's go ahead and do this. Okay. Uh, what we just had here... Give me a second. I do want to see... Do we have any rivalries? No. We're still improving relations with the Brits. Just fine. Let, let us improve more relations. Okay, U.S. is embargoing us, so let's... I can't do that. Could do some rivalries, though. Uh, Britain, who are you rivaling? Austria. Do I want to... You know what? Let's rival, actually... Okay. I think they're too low of a rank, are they not? Yeah, they're basically a minor power, so I can't really rival them. I could rival 
these guys. Okay, so we're not neighbors, but what are they? They're a great power. Why can't I rival them? That is weird. Okay, maybe we do need to get some more things in here. Uh, let's get doing this, because this is, I think... Well, we'll see if we can be able to get them doing. Let's get some Congo going. Some Niger River here. Uh, what else do we want an interest in? Uh, let's get the Andes. There we go. We'll do that. Let's see what all of this is going on. Uh, a deadly fire has killed kill workers in Pennsylvania. Okay, yeah, this is not good. Um, we'll do this. A famous cafe. After chance meeting in a cafe and a thoughtful conversation, Shubal Hallwell has recommended that James Ramsey, currently residing in Confederate Sovereign, Sovereigns of America, be granted permanent residence. James Ramsey, you're a reformer. Hmm. <coughs> I don't know if I want you. If we go... This is for the southern planters, right? Who is your leader at the moment? He's a traditionalist. Can't say I like any of these things you're pushing. Uh, but I'm kind of... I hate increasing their political strength, but... If we can pass... Uh, wealth voting, that should go a whole lot better for us. Yeah, because... If I radicalize them even more, they'll just be way more unhappy. So sure, let's go ahead and do that for now. Uh, uh, increased sightings of anti-American society members so socializing with lawmakers at restaurants and entertainment establishments are rising, raising concerns about lobbyist conduct. Uh, yeah, let's do this. That sounds fine. Uh, I kind of don't want anyone to go more radical, but let's go ahead and do this for now. It's the trade unions that are kind of a little bit pissed off. Which are part of this. Mm. A student member of the Oman Empires have defected to the trade unions. That's not good. Yeah, it's going to lose some bureaucracy, which is not the greatest. Yeah, let's try to coax some back. Okay, we're still doing more more buildings. And yeah, the west is a little bit on the uneducated side. Yeah, even this is a little bit tricky on the west. Yeah, okay. See what we can do here. Uh, market more glass. We're building some engines. Uh, let's try to get some more of wheat. New Mexico. You should be able to plant some more wheat. So let's go ahead and do you. And maybe California as well. Uh, we might want to switch some of our decrees here. Uh, 
let's go away the Alabama and let's get some people into California see what we can do here yeah let's pay off some of these debts and then go from there uh, oh man okay New Jersey mortality per turmoil you probably have ton of turmoil right now because you're in a state of yeah Sure, yeah, let's get more penalties from this turmoil. That's a-okay. I don't care about that at the moment. Okay, wealth voting is in consideration. Let's see what we can do about that. Okay, debate in here. Salmi Winthorpe, okay. Alvin Brown. Yeah, I think I'd rather do this than this. Because, again, more pop attraction. I don't want to give them the pop attraction. So, let's just go ahead and do this. That should be fine. And with discontent among the trade unions on the rise, I'm f ununiformed armed forces members and in New Jersey have formed detachments to directly repress the revolutionaries. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know what? I mean, I would like the armed forces to have a little more political power, but... I don't want to get yeah this is just a better thing to do at the moment numbers wise okay and we got an election going as well okay yeah 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 we should be fine on that we might have actually not a great government at the moment Oh no, we do have still a pretty good government. Okay, that's good. I do like that. Uh, well, for 11 months, okay. I mean, I'll have to deal with that for now. Um... Uh, Okay, what just happened here? I don't know what we voted for, but that's fine. Uh, some momentum. While well, campaigning for the Liberal Party in in the turmoil wrecked New Jersey, Harriet Tubman has been attacked and brutally beaten by a group of unknown assailants. Some rest and okay gets scarred wounded character health okay this might actually be best wounded shell shocked both of this is character health so in a total minus 16 m minus 60 percent I love this. Of course we know who it was. It was us. <laughs> you know, <laughs> just because I like the, just because I like this, let's go with that. Why not? And hopefully she may actually pass away. So let's see what happens in that. Uh, oh my god, more political strength for them. Uh, let's do this. That's fine. Uh, what are we doing here? Okay, glass is being built. More of that is being built. What else do we need, really? Uh, so let's get engines, coal, and paper. Uh, we'll get some more engines. 
and we'll build five in here. I know this is gonna not be too great. Uh, while we're at it, uh, let's get steam trains everywhere, please. Infrastructure. Yeah, let's get you going in here because you will need some sooner or later. Anyway, so let's go do that. Then we said some more paper, which is actually being already built, but... Uh, let's get three in Florida. That sounds good to me. And maybe some more coal. Which we're not doing dynamite, but let's do build some more coal. And let's get you five in here. Okay, there we go. Let's get that going. Mm. Let's go ahead and do this. Language in the classroom. Let's do this. More assimilation. Okay, we'll get that in a second here. And man employed by the anti-Russian association. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Um, maybe getting you some less political strength might be pretty good. So yeah, let's do that. Uh, we got more debate in here. Let's go ahead and do you like so. And then... How are we doing here? I mean, leaving it as is at 74. I do like that. So let, let's just leave it as is. Okay, we're doing pretty decently here. I mean, could be doing a little better. Uh, you need a general. Uh, sure, let's get you the cruel guy. That's fine. Navies, I don't know if I want to do any more navy stuff. Uh, sure, let's... Ooh, look at that. She died. Okay, that is actually good. I wonder, could we get this guy here is for landed voting. I can't exile you either. You're 77. Can you please die? You're an alcoholic. Because if they die, if he dies, that will be it. Uh, okay. Get scarred. I don't know if I like the market liberal thing. Let's say fair, child labor allowed, free trade. Well, okay. Yeah, okay, that's not that terrible. Uh, dispatch the army to rescue the him. Okay. Who is the him? No, don't want political strength for them. Uh, petite bourgeoisie. Is he actually your guys' leader? No, he's not because he can't be. Yeah, he's not. He's just, uh, what's it called? He's just a pol. Oh, he's West. I thought the king was the leader of him. Oh no, he's just a king, but he's not technically the leader of the petite bourgeoisie. Okay. And even the new heir. Oh no, he's a traditionalist. Prince James Washington. Okay. Um, all right. You know what? Let's get this guy to die. That's fine. 
Yeah. Let's see. You died, and then let's see who's your new leader. Reformer. Okay. But that's fine for now. Get a stall. Um... Uh, More bureaucracy cost, which is not the greatest. Sure, let's go ahead and do this. Okay, but for now, I will put a cut in here. So, thanks a lot for coming and watching another episode. And I will catch you next time. Bye-bye.